Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Cooking with the Baileys. Today we're going to be making banana bread. I have three bananas here that I've mashed up to get the process going faster. Ripe bananas is what you need. So to the, to the ripe bananas, I'm gonna add my vanilla. And my lemon juice. I'm just mixing it now because I don't want to overwork it once I start to add it to my flour. So that's what you want to do. To that, I'm going to add my cinnamon, two tablespoons of cinnamon. I like a lot of cinnamon in my banana bread. You can cut it to your liking if you want. I'm going to set it aside. Um, I have two cups of flour in here and I have my grated nutmeg, like one whole nutmeg is fine. That would do. I have one teaspoon of, look in here, I have half a teaspoon of salt. I have one teaspoon of baking powder and baking soda. I'm going to mix that in. Mix it well. Half a cup of brown sugar and white sugar, half each. We're gonna mix that as well. Make sure it's well combined. Making this juicy, juicy banana bread, okay? Just until it's well incorporated. Because sometimes the sugar had lumps and we don't want all the lump in there. We're going to set that aside. I'm going to whisk two eggs. Whisk it together, add that to your banana mixture. I have one stick of melted butter. Make sure your butter is cool before you add it because you don't want to um, have fried eggs. This bread is going to be moist. I have half a cup of heavy cream is what I'm using because I want that moist bread. Heavy cream. If you want to use half and half, you can use that. But I'm using heavy cream. You want to use buttermilk, you can also use it. But I'm using heavy cream in mine. See how that's nice and juicy? <laughs> okay, I'm going to put it all in here right now so I don't overwork my dough. Just fold it in. Now, you gently mix it in. Gently mix. We are not whisking. We're just getting it com well combined. Hmm, it smells so good. The vanilla and the cinnamon and the nutmeg in this. 
Yummy. Okay, so it's combined. We're going to put it in our loaf pan. Make sure you grease your pan, okay guys? so good I can smell it so your two cups of flour three bananas gonna give you one loaf of banana bread mm. if you like nuts crush your nuts and pour it over and put it in the oven on 325 degrees for about 30 minutes okay just check in check on it keep your eye on it i'm gonna put mine in my oven right now just make sure you tap it to take away the air bubbles and i'll okay our bread here is done i'm gonna flip it over oh yeah because I use a non-stick pan, so it's still hot. It came right out the oven. And it's hot, 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 hot. So I'm gonna just slice a piece so we kinda, I don't know why I'm using a small bread knife, but hey. I just want y'all to see what it looks like, okay? I, I told you it was going to be moist, right? And it is moist. It's very hot, as you can see. I'm just trying to get this over with because it's kind of late right now and I got work in the morning, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I wanted to do this for you guys. You see, my bread is always moist. That's how I like it. I'm gonna just try a little bit. Even though I know it's hot, it, I'm late. It's like 12 something in the morning. Okay, guys, I had to do this for you guys real quick. Got to go to work, but give my banana bread a try. And if you like it, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, okay? And make sure you share, 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 share a lot. Share this video, okay? So you can give me energy to do more. <laughs> All right, guys. Have a good night. Take care.